Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to All Under the Squirrel Tree. I'm really glad you're here joining me in the dray. Uh, today I am doing a Sticker Saturday. It's hosted by Crafting Rose. I'm late to the game because I did a Dollarama Timu haul on Saturday and it took until today, which is Sunday, to upload. Uh, quick question there. How long does it take for people's things to upload? Um, my 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 Dollarama Timu haul was a 39-minute video, and it took well over 12 hours to upload. So I'm going to keep this short and sweet, and hopefully it'll be uploaded by next Saturday. Uh, anyway, I do hope you'll forgive me for popping in a day late, but I really wanted to get this done so that I could get on with the project. And get it up on my wall. I'm making a clock. Uh, I got this clock at Dollarama back in the early summer. Um, it was five dollars. It comes with the complete mechanism that you need. Hanger. Takes one AA battery. And I'm not sure how good the mechanism is because I haven't tried it yet, which I should have, especially before I put in all this work. Uh, making the clock. I love black and pink together. I love black cats. I've got the most beautiful black cat in the world named Opal. Um, so naturally my clock was going to be pink with black cats. So clock is from Dollarama. Paint was from Dollarama. This was four four fifty four dollars excellent value I know this is not stickers but um, stickers are part of crafting paint is part of crafting and I really wanted to let you see this stuff because this is what this is painted with it is a artist series acrylic paint in these 80 milliliter 80 milliliter pots it's beautiful paint I'm really really impressed with the quality how smoothly it goes on how evenly it goes on I was really, really happy, and it's perfect for this wooden surface um, of my clock. Now, I have these stickers. I got them from Timu. Uh, again, quite a long time ago. It takes me, I buy things, and it takes me a long time to figure out what to do with them. But they're just simple black cats, and I might trim down the white around it a tiny bit. I just, I don't know. I will try one and decide. Um, I have is this little sleeping black kitty, which I think would probably be really good for 10 o'clock. I've got this sort of stretching kitty, which would be good for 9 o'clock. Let's see if we move it over so you can see it. Uh, no, you know what? This is a sleepy kitty, but not yet asleep. And there's 7 o'clock. Wait a minute. 9, 8. <laughs> Wide awake, kitty. Feed me, kitty. Getting ready to go all feed me, kitty. <laughs> my, my cat is looking at me. <laughs> she hears the word feed. Uh. Is it's four o'clock? What are you doing? Are you going to feed me? It's three o'clock. I just woke up from a nap. Big stretch. Whoops! I dropped one. Which one did I drop? I hope it wasn't the. It was. Of course it was. And I'm wearing a black and white dress. So. Black and white sticker on a black and white dress. Yeah. Okay, well, we'll just, and there's two o'clock and one o'clock and let's see. I have a really, really cute one with one looking up at the stars. I think that might be the one that I use for 11 o'clock. But uh, in the meantime, it's the purring kitty for 11 o'clock and then observing the world 
at 12 o'clock. So that will be the hours. And I have these little nail stickers um, that I'm going to use, I think, I have to move these in a little bit. I haven't quite decided 100% for sure, but that's, you know, one of the things with crafting. You change your mind whenever you like, right? These will be all nice and positioned properly. Uh, having these just run around these little ones, because they're all different positions. Very, very cute. they got some of the Atomic, it's hard to see because they're so tiny, but um, the Atomic Kitty, you know, like from, excuse me, from the 50s, that type. I love that style. I've got a few of them around my apartment. Um, just very sweet little kitty cats. And just put them around for a border. Don't know. Not 100% sure. We'll decide eventually. But yeah, that's it. That's my sticker project for, well, Saturday. Um, next Saturday, with all, hopefully everything will go well. And I will be able to show you on a sticker Saturday the result of all of the sticker don't stick um, stickers on the on the uh, clock but that's my plan um, if you have any questions or comments or if you're watching for the first time and you would like to subscribe I'd appreciate it very much uh, trying to put everything back in this little container so I don't also oh, look even black kitty cat on the <laughs> There's a, uh, there's a rubber stamp I was thinking about using, but I have decided against for this particular project. So let me put it away before I lose it. And the main reason I'm not doing it is because I don't have archival ink, and I have to varnish this, and I don't want it to run. So that is what I've got going on. I haven't done a sticker Saturday in a very long time. But I'm glad to be doing one again. And I apologize for it being on a Sunday. And by the time it uploads, because it's seven and a half minutes long, it'll probably be Friday. I'm kidding. Hopefully. <laughs> anyway. Thank you for coming and visiting Under the Tree. I'll see you again soon. Bye.